These old tin plate road wheels are often thrown away or else the brass boss is pinched out of it. Nobody likes using them much. But they can be used for something else. A bolt can be fastened to the rim inside the wheel just by using washers clamped between nuts. You have to do it in a jig to get them spaced right and you can also bend it a bit. This is my second attempt at building a Meccano clock using 20 Meccano parts not counting nuts, bolts, washers or spring clips. The spring clip pallets and the weights on this pulley here are adjusted so that the wheel below turns once every 27.06 seconds. This escapement wheel has got 11 3 quarter inch bolts fitted around the rim. Ideally for a folio and verge mechanism you should always have an odd number of teeth so that as one is released another one is caught at the top. I didn't have a normal large 133 tooth gear available at the time so I've built one up from this 95 tooth and a 3.5 inch gear ring which gives the same result but I've just counted it as one part for the purposes of our 20 parts in the competition. The escapement wheel turns once every 27.06 seconds. That gets reduced by 7 to 1 using the large gear with a 19 tooth pinion behind it then by a further 19 to 1 using the pinion above it here. 27.06 times 7 times 19 comes out at 3600 seconds which is exactly the duration of one hour from this shaft here. The minute hand is a long bolt attached by a series of spring clips and nuts and bolts which aren't counted in the parts allowance. The hour hand here is a bolt attached to the boss of this 60 tooth gear which is reduced by 12 to 1 from the gearing at the back. A low friction needle bearing is made using a special bolt from the Electrokit set.